These are the wrist weights we're going to be using. Uh, they're very easy to put on and take off. I would strongly recommend using light weights to start with and then gradually build upon it. These are a pound and a half, very easy to put on and very easy to take off. And this will help build resistance in your body and strengthen your upper body. And you'll find you'll feel so much better from it. And you can do these Qigong moves with or without the weights, whatever is best for you. Also, I will be mirror imaging these moves. Feet together, I bow and honor you all. Step out with the left leg, palms open. Slowly breathe in and exhale as you sink softly in your knees and the arms come down. Gather the energy, breathing in. Turn a hand over, exhale softly, coming down. Make sure you sink in slightly in your knees. Breathing in. Let the arms feel like they're floating down. This will help strengthen the shoulders and arms and the legs with the bending of the knees. The next move is opening the energy gates. The palms come together up to the chest level. Open the arms out slowly. And your exhale coming back. So you're breathing in. As you exhale, again you sink in the knees. Breathing in. Exhale, sink. This is a great movement for your chest, arms, shoulder, and legs. And sink. Step out with your left leg a little bit, widen your shoulders. Picking up the energy ball, squatting down. Inhale up over the head, looking up. Exhale slowly coming down. Squatting down again. Inhale up. Exhale as the arms come down. Bending again. Inhale up. Exhale. This move really works your legs, your back, your arms, shoulders, and your core. Your feet are shoulder width apart. You're holding the moon between your palms of your hand called moon gazing. Your knees squat, you rise up to the right. Your heel comes up on the left leg. You slowly come back, bending the knees. Rise up to the left. The heel comes up on the right leg. Now the breathing on this goes like this. You exhale up. You inhale as you're coming down and squatting. And you exhale as you go up looking up at the moon. So here you're working your legs, your back, your shoulders and arms, and your neck. Feet shoulder width apart, push and return. Two fists by your waist, push the left hand out, turn it over, look at the palm of your hand as you turn all the way to the back as far as you can go comfortably. Slowly bring the hand back, Grab the chi and pull it in. Take the right hand, push out, turn the palm over, breathing in as you turn. As you come back, you're exhaling slowly. You're grabbing the chi, pull it into the waist. Push the left hand out, same thing, inhaling. Turn as far as you can go comfortably. 
Exhaling slowly, coming back. Grab the chi, pull it in. Same thing with the right hand, turn it over, inhale. Exhale, coming back. Grab the chi, pull it in. This is a great move for your waistline, shoulders, arms, and neck. Feet come together, hands will come up to your chest. Waves of the universe, step out 10 o'clock with the left leg, push down towards the floor, unhinge the wrists, and drop back. Toes will come up on the left leg. You exhale down. Inhale, coming back. Exhale. Inhale. This move here is working your wrists, your back, your shoulders, and arms. Leg comes in, step out two o'clock with the right foot. Push down, exhale, inhale, coming back. Step out with your left leg shoulder width, called bird flying. Squat down, touch the side of your ankles, rise up, arms float up as if you're flying, and the hands come down slowly. Squatting down, inhale as you come up. Exhale as the arms come down. Squat down, touching the ankles, rising up, arms floating up and floating down. Squatting down, touching the side of the ankles. Inhale as you come up, open the arms, Exhale down. This movement is an overall workout for the whole body. This next move is the marionette. The left arm will float up and the left leg comes up with it. The right arm will float up and the right leg comes up. Inhale up, exhale down. Inhale coming up, exhale going down. Pretend you're a puppet and the strings are being pulled. This move will help your balance, works your legs, arms and shoulders. Also helps in concentrating. The last movement, the lotus flower closing. The palms open up, bring the hands up as you breathe in and the hands come together over your head. You exhale as you bring it down to the chest area. You open the hands into a lotus flower. You breathe in. As you exhale, close the flower into two fists. Breathe in and push it out to the universe. 
As you exhale, you let it go. Come back into prayerful pose. Left leg comes in. Peace and blessings.